Hold up, so apparently my brother decided to trick me and instead of just doing a taste testing video He told me that we were actually doing an eat it or wear it challenge and things got really messy very quickly And here's a little preview of the video No, mine didn't open <laughs> Yours has more! Yes, bring it. I bring it on. Hey. Bring it on like Donkey Kong. Bring it. Okay, so this is our first one. Quite quite corn snack. Let's just let's just pop it open. Does it smell good? Mm, no. Oh. <laughs> There's peanut butter in this. Okay. Ready? One, two, three. Mmm. It doesn't taste good. It just doesn't taste bad. No. 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 It's a just no no. Okay, so apparently that's not sweet. It's kind of, it's got a weird seafood taste at the end. What do you think? Yeah, it tastes like shrimp or something. I'll give it a 5 out of a 10. Alright, now we're gonna be trying milk <laughs> from Japan. And thank God the expiration date is in 2019. Smells good. What do you think it will taste like? And what do you think it will be? I think it will taste like yogurt. I feel like it's gonna taste like a butterscotch candy corn. This is the strongest piece of candy you will ever eat. One, two, three. Mmm. It tastes really good. Are you done? Okay, so here are my thoughts That's about pretty this. good. Yeah, I think this is a 10 out of 10. And also, it really reminds me of pina colada. <laughs> I rate this a 10 out of 10. I would eat this. Crispy fish rolls. Amira, we're trying sweet things and you got crispy fish it was, rolls. It was pink. It looks pretty sweet to you, right? If you don't read it. Crispy fish rolls. Now, if it was in Chinese, I would understand. But it's in <laughs> English. I didn't realize it. Well, at least they're non-fried. <laughs> Oh. Okay, I'm just gonna try a bite of this. I'm not gonna eat the whole no, thing. No, you're gonna eat the whole thing. One, two, three, go! <laughs> 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 oh, give me some of that candy. <laughs> oh man, the cat smelled the fish! <laughs> that is nasty. No. <laughs> Sorry. That is some gross stuff, guys. Next. 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 Hello Kitty rice crackers. Again, Amira. What makes you think that it this looks, is sweet? It looks sweet, okay? It's just got a cat on it. Look at it, it looks sweet. Okay. Look, it's got a pack of two. Oh. This doesn't even have Hello Kitty imprinted on it. Yes. It's on the packaging. Why would it have Hello Kitty imprinted on it? Because I yeah. thought it would. I feel like this won't really taste like anything. They probably just taste kind of like a rice cracker. Sour oh, something. you think it'll taste like a rice cracker? Yeah. You think the Hello Kitty rice crackers will taste like rice crackers? Yes. <laughs> One, yeah. two, three. Tastes like a rice cracker. It wasn't. It was a five out of a uh, five out of ten. I give it a three out of ten. It wasn't bad. It wasn't good, but it was more bad than good. Next. Right now we got. See, they put labels on the ones that don't have English on them. Yeah. Anyways, it says, "Hot Kid Milk Chewy Candy Chocolate Flavor." It seems like it is sweet, so I think I did good on Finally, that one. Finally, it's a wrapper within the wrapper. Inception. So pretty. Okay. Go! <laughs> I 
I'm going to rate this a 7 out of 10 because it's not that good, but it's pretty good. And the outside tastes like coconut, and the inside tastes really good because it's like chocolate. Coconut? I tasted milk. I rate it a 6 out of 10. Next! This one I was really excited to try out because it has marshmallows in it, I think. And that is marshmallow. Yeah, it looks really good. Oh, no. They're so cute. But guys, I think mm. there's jelly inside. One, two, three. That's some good stuff there. That's some good stuff. It's got this jelly in the middle, and it tastes. This is like a waffle. So good. Ten out of ten. If I could do it like twenty out of ten, I would. Next. Whoa! It's, it's got, got a, a map. map. And it shows you where dolphins are and cows. It even shows you where popsicles are. Popsicles? Okay, right, so anyway. I guess if we ever go to China or wherever this is, this is we have a map. Taiwan. Oh, Taiwan. If we ever go to Taiwan. Those look pretty good. I think they're This sweet. is called Taro Mochi. A bag within a bag. Alright. Oh, they even got their own like milk nutrition pack. Yeah, it's just. This is high end. Go. Mm. Mm. Oh. What is this? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay, Don't get it is... away from me. So my rating for that was a three out of a ten because it was okay. I say one out of ten because if I had to eat it again for some reason, I would. But I will never think about it ever again. Yeah, Not like, even in my sleep. Popping candy, watermelon, artificially flavored. Which this just basically looks like pop rocks, except I think that this package looks like it's a lot more intense than pop rocks. Okay. I found out how to open it. They come in very small packages. Oh. <laughs> Some good stuff. Okay, well that wasn't more intense than normal crack rocks, but um, it's still really good. And the watermelon tastes really good. I think I might have another pack too. Mm. That's good. I give that a ten out of a ten. I give this a ten out of ten because it is delicious and awesome, and I I mean pop rocks are just awesome. So. Honey butter flavored peanuts. One, two, three. They taste like normal peanuts to me. <laughs> well, I rate it an eight out of ten because it's good. They're so peanuts, good. so you know. But I'm not gonna go eat it. I'm gonna give it a seven out of ten. Oh god, not one of these again. One, two, smells good. Three. <sighs> <sighs> I think these might have been just the same thing as the other ones. Oh, well, that didn't work out. <laughs> it's sweet. All right, ready? One, two, three. <laughs> I give it seven out of ten. I gave it a five out of ten because I wasn't too fond of these when I was little. So, okay, I can't really do this. Just. Okay, now we got preserved fruit. <laughs> Half of it. One, two, go. Oh, look, I'm about to see you in the middle. Yeah. That's an 8 out of 10 for the preserved plum. Yeah. I think I'll take it 8 out of 10 because it's pretty good, but um, it's not the best. These are Hello Kitty biscuits with chocolate cream. Oh, it's like one of those Nutella things. Ooh! This is probably the most American thing I've ever seen. <laughs> what I'm saying in our whole collection of stuff. This is all the chocolate you give me? Do you seriously see this, you guys? Tell me if you think this is enough chocolate. Ready? Okay. Cling. I give this a 7 out of 10. I give this, yeah, a 7 out of 10. Sounds good. 
the last one. This one seems pretty good. Um, it has like some weird uh, stuff coming out of it. We all each get our own pack. Ready? Halfway. I'm not a fan of them. I give them a five out of ten. I give it a nine out of ten because they taste pretty good, and I would eat them on a daily basis. Oh, that's the last thing. Okay, so what was your favorite one, Charlie? Definitely this cotton candy. Cotton candy. Cotton cup sweets. This one was probably my favorite, and also like this popping candy one. That was pretty good. Okay, so that was my video, and I really, really hope you guys liked it. And if you did, please press that like button. Also, don't forget to check out Charlie's channel and his video too. And don't forget to comment down below your video suggestions, or if you want me to try any other like different foods, like I don't know, like British snacks or something like that. And then also, don't forget to subscribe to give my channel a little try and become a new member of the family. I welcome you with a great big hug. Good luck. I love you guys so much, and I really, really hope I see you guys next time, and bye!